What brings you out here lying in the cold on the ground today? Uh, what brings me out here is those babies who are taken out of the mother's womb and uh, don't grow up and do great things that they were meant to do because someone uh, can't, you know, uh, take care of that baby or doesn't want to and so they take away that baby. That's what brings me out. So you're laying on behalf of that child. Now, um, are you a college student, high school student? Uh, what would make someone in, in your, of your age to decide that they wanted to speak on behalf of the unborn? Uh, I'm a high school student, and um, it's 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 about uh, that person's heart. If they uh, if they believe in the cause that uh, what they're what they're uh, standing here, or in our case, laying for, um, then they'll do it. And uh, yeah, it, it breaks my heart to see those babies uh, taken out and taken away from that mother and that family. And your yourself, sir? Well, Are you high school too? Or yeah. call it. Oh my, very young men. I'm a senior in high school, so I'm about to graduate. Okay. Uh, but for me, we're both uh, we both adopted uh, when we were really young, and so I think we both relate to the same kind of hope that we want those children to have uh, that we're passionate for in the pro-life movement. So it's really about adoption too, as well for us, giving them you know something on the back end, something to look forward to. You know, adoption is a wonderful option. And in fact, a major denomination in the African American community now is focusing a lot of time and attention on adoption. So we're seeing some more national discussion. Uh, what can you tell us about your home that you say this is a comfortable space, that enough that you would come out to a pro-life march? Oh, it's, a, it's an amazing opportunity that I've been giving just to have another life, a second chance that I wouldn't have ever had, you know, if I, I wasn't adopted. Um, just to just to have a, the ability to do whatever I want to do um, and just pursue my dreams that I can have because I was adopted. Uh, that's an incredible opportunity that you can't have any other way. So. Can we peek into any of those dreams? What are you thinking about? You're a senior. Uh, so I want to pursue um, a career in the military wow. as an intelligence officer in the Marine Corps. Uh, so I applied Simplified. to the Naval Academy, and uh, oh, yes, yeah. ma'am. So okay. I'm looking forward to that. Oh, wonderful, wonderful. Star Parker here reporting from the die-in at the White House with two incredible young men who God just said, oh, no, this one's not going to go the way of the others. This one's going into my safety in a protected home, an adopted home. And we just heard tomorrow's future, and I'm excited. Star Parker reporting here live on behalf of BlackCommunityNews.com. Thank you, young man. <laughs> Thank you. Very nice. I think they want you guys somewhere. I don't want you to miss your... Thanks for loaning us your children. Okay, are you going down that bus? What's going on? Oh, okay. We're walking to the metro. Oh, you're walking to the metro. Okay, because I'm like, I've got to wrap this one up. Okay. All right, so now we're on our own to get over to the Supreme Court, they said. So you guys got to go to the court? Yeah. Okay, good, good. So you just Uber over there? Yeah. So who's going to Uber in which groups? Yeah, let's see. Okay, you guys are going to roll together. Della, you can go with me. 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 Me.